India's got a huge open defecation problem. If there's not good toilets, then people just defecate out in the open. The kids get exposed. Then you'll see incredible rates of diarrhea. Your water actually gets completely polluted by all that fecal sludge that's out in the environment. A lot of what people use are pit latrines. And the challenge there is that the fecal sludge builds up. Eventually, it overflows, and you're going to stop using that toilet. I get to India at least once a year because to see the progress here, to you know, talk to the partners, there is a lot of progress here in India. It's 1.3 billion people, so uh, it's going to take a long time. But uh, people want to change. Prime Minister Modi, looking at the amount of open defecation, looking at the effects on malnutrition, he goes to all the departments, the different states, and says, let's get going, getting much, much better sanitation. And so this is an amazing time to be partnering with India. And so as we talk to India and seeing this ambitious goal India set of getting rid of open defecation, we said, OK, let's, let's come up with great solutions. For the toilets that exist, we need to make sure that sludge gets taken to a place where it can be treated properly and make sure, instead of just dumping it somewhere, that there's a processing facility that could help with the toilets we have today. So we've been working on an omniprocessor. The omniprocessor is a machine that renders human waste free of pathogens and turns it into fertilizer. So great engineers working on that omniprocessor for today's toilets. We actually had a contest. The foundation brought together all the scientists who have an idea of reinventing the toilet uh, so that instead of having to take the sludge away, you just chemically process it or burn it, it's gone. And now our partners are out piloting these things. So there's a village uh, where a couple households are trying out a reinvented toilet. The key criteria for reinvent a toilet is, first of all, that it can't smell. It's also got to be super inexpensive. A lot of universities and companies came together and showed ideas. One of those was Caltech. Now uh, they partnered up with Kohler, and they've got a pilot going. And here are the idea is that instead of having this waste that you have to take away, that instead you can use chemical means to completely get rid of the smell, get disease-causing properties. And so it's a radical new approach. We believe that a reinvented toilet will become a reality. Once you get great toilets, then you can convince people that they all should be used. The health of the village, the quality of life improves dramatically. And in the years ahead, you're going to see real improvements in sanitation here and these lessons will help us solve the problem in other countries as well. The hope is that young kids like these will be able to grow up with good toilets for a cleaner, safer, healthier world.